in today's headlines, the 11th session, the last one of the 14th legislature, wrapped up. Kentucky City organized the gathering with about 100 Khmer people on the occasion of John Chanang Tomei traditional day 2021. Leaders came to inspect preparation for the 15th National Assembly and demonstrated the People's Council at all levels in 2021-2026 term. Hello, it's good to have you back here in this edition of Continuous and Top News today. After 12 days of working in the spirit of hurry and responsibility, in the afternoon of April 8, the legislator fulfilled the agenda of the 11th session, the last one of the 14th legislature. Important and useful experiences were reviewed and personal tasks were adopted and perfected. This serves as the premise for timely implementing the resolution of the 13th National Party Congress and following development moves of the nation. In this session, the National Assembly set aside plenty of time to discuss and evaluate the reports on performance of the National Assembly, State President, the Government, the Organization of the National Assembly, Supreme People's Court, Supreme People's Procuracy and State Audit. Citizens and voters nationwide acknowledge that the legislature and its organizations have promoted solidarity, responsibility, and strong renewal, achieving holistic achievements in all aspects of work, creating an important foundation so that the next term of the National Assembly can carry on with method renewal, further enhancing the quality and operational efficiency of the legislature. Carrying out the personnel task after the 13th National Party Congress, the National Assembly considered and decided on the relief, election, and approval of some parts in the state organization, ensuring democracy, law abidance, and high consensus. National Assembly Chairman Vương Đình Huệ expressed his sincere and deep gratitude toward the valuable confidence and support of citizens and voters nationwide. He thanked the timely and close leadership of the Party Central Executive Committee, Politburo Secretariat, and the coordination of concerned offices and organizations which have facilitated National Assembly's accomplishment of tasks in the past tenure. Earlier in the morning of April 8, the National Assembly ratified the appointment of two deputy prime ministers and 12 ministers head of ministerial level bodies. After studying and discussing the list of nominations submitted by Prime Minister Phạm Minh Chính, National Assembly deputies casted secret ballots and approved the ratification and appointment of 12 ministers, heads of ministerial level bodies. The resolution recognizing results of the ratification and appointment was passed at the rate of 455 out of 459 votes. Coming to attend and deliver instructions at the open meeting of the Executive Board of Kerang Urban District Party Committee to review performance in the first quarter of 2021 held in the morning of April 8, permanent member of Kentucky City Party Committee, come stand and vice chairman of Kentucky City People's Committee, Yung Tung Hing, requested the Executive Board of Kerang Urban District Party Committee to continue while doing the party building task and political system building to focus on giving instructions on the election of the 15th National Assembly and Deputy of People's Councils at all levels in 2021-2026 term. State and Vice Chairman Yung Tung Hing also noted the locality to continue while carrying out the dual missions of both controlling COVID-19 epidemic and developing social economy to well manage the basic construction to speed up progress of projects. In the first quarter, the Executive Board of Kerang District Party Committee organized the implementation of political tasks with many active results. Economy continued its settled development. The rate of medical security coverage stood at 83.29%. On this occasion, one team and seven party members who excellently completed tasks in five consecutive years were presented merit certificates. In the morning of April 8, Kentucky City organized a gathering with around 100 Khmer people on the occasion of John Tanam Tomei traditional day 2021. Coming to attend were representative leaders of the local administration number 3 minority committee, military zone 9, and leaders of Kentucky City. At the gathering, delegates heard John Tanam Tomei that 
greetings offered from the party committee, People's Council, Vietnam Father and French Committee of Kansas City. The letter emphasized that in a complicated context of COVID-19 epidemic, Khmer nuns, monks, and minority people have united and made efforts to well carry out social economic development tasks and ensure local security policies. With this spirit, the city hopes Khmer nuns, monks, and people to continue preserving and promoting the traditions of solidarity, patriotism, distinguished cultural values of Khmer minority people, and actively join patriotic Malaysian movements and contribute more to building and developing Kansas City to 2030 vision to 2045 to be an ecological, civilized, modern city imbued with cultural features of the Hick region in conformity with the Politburo Resolution No. 59-2020. Also in the morning of April 8, permanent member of Kansas City Party Committee come chairman of Kansas City's Vietnam Father and French Committee, come vice chairman of the Election Committee of Kansas City Nguyễn Trung Nhân, came to inspect preparations for the 15th National Assembly and deputies of People's Councils at all levels in 2021-2026 time in Thuc Nộp Upper District. After the second consultative meeting, the standing board of Top Nob District's Vietnam Father and Funds Committee agreed to finalize preliminary list of 62 nominees to Top Nob District's People's Council. It's up now the standing board of Vietnam Father and Funds Committees of the district and was have organized to solicit opinions from residents who live in the same place as nominees. Other preparation tasks such as visual propaganda training have also been concerned. Political security, social safety order, and COVID-19 epidemic control were also ensured. The list of official nominees will be announced in the third consultative meeting slated on April 15, 2021 or April 18 at the latest. On April 8, the Mission Group No. 8 of the City's Election Commission and the head of permanent member of Kansas City Party Committee, come director of Kansas City's Public Security Nguyễn Văn Thuận, came to check the election of the 15th legislature and deputies of People's Councils at all levels in 2021-2026 term in Omon District. The group checked the election task in Chavon Lim and Thái Hòa Walls. Each of now election commission of the walls have basically completed set plans and posted the list of voters on April 12th. The third consultative meeting will be held on April 14th to finalize list of nominees. On April 8th, Kansas City's inspection group on election at the head of Colonel Jim Thống Nhất, permanent member, come commander-in-chief of the city's military command, came to take the election task in Cardo Suburban District. Cardo Suburban District focused on directing and organizing to ensure stabilization. After the second consultative meeting, Cardo Suburban District finalized the preliminary list of 64 nominees. Opinions from residents have also been solicited. Delivering instruction, Colonel Jim Thống Nhất requested French committees of 10 communes, towns of Gado, to closely combine with people's committees of the same levels to strengthen propaganda on the election, well carry out security orders, social safety measures, and well implement COVID-19 control measures. And as usual, before moving to the close, let's take a quick look at the updated weather forecast. The updated weather forecast they just wrapped up this edition of Continues. If you want to watch again in this bulletin, please visit our website, kentertv.vn. And thanks for being with us. Goodbye and see you next time.